To Steve from Pablo, are you this shit? I'm sick of this shit. You've become too sexy to live with. As of now, I am no longer your roommate. I moved down the street as I have taken up with a woman who is uglier than you and dumber than me. Dumber than I. I plan to give her many filthy children and at least one STD. Don't think just because I'm gone that you can do some risky business dancing around lip syncing in your underwear mess. Let's play out and you know it. Well, FOD, love Pablo. Telling me what I can do in my own home. Alright, where's my Bob Seeker collection? Hey man, did you just... Hey man, did you see that play? Yeah, well, your mama's so stupid, she got a zero on a piss test. Man, this... Man, this sucks. Yeah, hey, hey, is uh, Raleigh there? Yeah. In the clink? I don't know what that means, but um, when he gets out, tell him to call Steve, all right? Like five to ten, like five to ten minutes? Oh, okay. Well, well thanks anyway. <sighs> That's three in a row. Do I know any law-abiding people? Let's see. Oh, maybe some uh, misdemeanor charges. Let's look at those. Oh, this guy can't even live near a school. Craigslist. See what we got. Male bachelor, late twenties, mid twenties. Seeks male roommate between the ages of twelve and sixty-four for rent and bill sharing, camaraderie, and general tomfoolery. Must be between four and seven on the American standardized ugliness scale, and enjoy you mama snaps. Female nudist will also be considered. All right, send. Well, I had it narrowed down to three potential roommate candidates, but unfortunately one of them got arrested about nine minutes ago for public indecency. So, yeah. That's a bummer. Yes! Well, it might have been. Well, I do appreciate you guys responding to my ad so quickly. The internet is magic. Yes! Well, I've reviewed your stats and your information. And I've seen that you're actually both threes on the uh, Max Holsey penis chart. You might actually be a 2.5. Two and a quarter, maybe? 2.5, you know, if you lost up some weight. I'm happy with who I am. Yes! So, I'm gonna give you a scenario to see how you would react. That way I can make my final decision. I want to be prepared for any possibilities. Yes! Swell. Here's the scenario. I am running for president. You've got my vote. Yes! No. I'm not actually running for president. Let's just say that I am and I ask you to be my running mate. You honor me. Yes! No, no, no. 
Just listen to the scenario. The press starts hounding you about my past, and they bring up this incident where I kind of sort of accidentally held up a Dunkin' Donuts. I blame the distribution of wealth in this country. Yes! Okay, forget the scenario. Does anyone have a coin I can flip? Money is an illusion. Yes! Yes, you have a coin I can flip, or yes, you're agreeing with him about the illusionary characterization of currency? He's talking to you. Yes! Okay, you, you're gone. Bye-bye. You, welcome home. I'm very excited about this. Yeah, I'm, I'm glad to hear it. Now listen, uh, we're about nine weeks behind on the rent at this point, so you're probably going to want to get on that pretty quick. And uh, there's no running water anymore. We're pretty much old school here. But I tell you what, you're going to love this place, Pablo. My name is Dave. Yeah, you're going to have to learn to let that one go. Okay. Oh, your mama's such a bitch, she took first place at the American Kennel Club show. That's a clever joke, man. Pablo Dave, from Steve, R.E. You, Adnus. Fuck you, I'm out. Probably for the best. <laughs>